most churches will have an Advent wreath holding four candles, representing a different focus for each week we prepare for the birth of Jesus. Churches will light a new candle each week leading up to Christmas. Each candle represents something, hope, peace, joy, and love. The Catholic Church adopted this tradition during the Middle Ages as we prepare for the hearts and the minds for Christmas. The word Advent itself comes from the Latin word Adventus, meaning arrival. We prepare for the arrival of Christ. The wreath itself represents eternity and everlasting life, a circle that never ends. Three purple candles and a pink candle adorn the outside of the wreath. We focus this week on the first purple candle, the candle of hope. Like the prophets in the Old Testament, we hope for a Messiah to save us from the sin in the world. We anticipate our Savior's arrival. Also known as the prophecy candle, this candle assures us we can have the hope that God will fulfill the prophecies declared in the Old Testament about Jesus. Hope doesn't disappoint us. In this day and age, where unrest is felt and all seems uncertain, we can also hope that the prophecies about Jesus' second arrival to earth will also be fulfilled. The purple color on the candle represents repentance and fasting as we anticipate the Lord's coming. And so we pray, Heavenly Father, Advent is a time for remembering and reflecting on the birth of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Father, we pray that you will turn our hearts toward you as Christmas approaches. Let us not get caught up in the hustle and bustle of the season this year and miss the chance to celebrate the gifts of hope, peace, joy, and love that you sent to us on that first Christmas. Father God, every word in scripture points to the gift of hope that we have because of Christ Jesus. The Christmas story wasn't the beginning of that message of hope because the Old Testament is full of glimpses of your plan to redeem your people and restore them into a relationship with you. But we are able to truly begin to see and understand just how great your love for us is when we read the story of Jesus' birth in scripture. Help us to see that you are with us. That first Christmas, you gave us the gift of hope wrapped in swaddling clothes and laid in a manger. Thank you, Father, for your immeasurable gift. In Jesus' precious name we pray, amen. <laughs> 